Welcome to another Ayehu tutorial. Today, we'll be talking about integrating Ayehu iShare with SolarWinds NPM. Ayehu iShare is a lightweight IT process automation solution that enables IT teams to effectively manage their daily activities related to IT operations, from simple repetitive IT tasks to complex processes across multiple systems. Ayehu iShare extends SolarWinds network performance monitor capabilities using its out-of-the-box two-way integration. You can execute process workflows triggered by SolarWinds alerts to respond to and resolve issues faster. Let's see how it works in less than five minutes. First, make sure you download and install the SolarWinds integration pack from the Ayehu website and that you have the SolarWinds NPM installed and accessible. Now, let's set up and configure the iShare integration. Open iShare Studio, and under Configuration, Modules, let's define a new module. Select SolarWinds NPM. Enter the module name, description, and select the device on which the module is installed. Usually, it'll be localhost, as we have here. Next, hit Configure to define module settings. Select the device on which the SolarWinds NPM is installed. The device should be previously defined under Incident Management Devices. Enter the username and password. The user should be a member of the SolarWinds NPM operators group. Now, press the Test Connection button to establish the connection with your SolarWinds NPM and make sure it's all set up correctly. There you go. Press the Filter Settings button in order to define which alerts will be pulled by iShare from the SolarWinds NPM. Here's a sample we'll use called Alert Name, which pulls alerts referred to as Alert Me When the Free Space of a Volume is Less Than 10%. Press Update to update the filter settings. Use the Mapping button if you'd like to change the mapping between SolarWinds NPM properties to iShare built-in variables. Save your new module settings and make sure it's up. Let's switch to the iShare dashboard in which you can view your current critical alerts handled by iShare. Now let's take a look at how we handle SolarWinds alerts. Currently, there are no alerts, but stay tuned. In the meantime, we'll jump over for a minute to our ticketing system. We're using ServiceNow. Currently, there are no open tickets in the system either. But let's see what happens when disk space on drive C hits its threshold. SolarWind spots the disk space issue, and there's the alert right there. The alert is sent to iShare, where it shows up on the dashboard, triggering an automated workflow. We can track its progress in the active logs on the bottom of the screen. The workflow checks whether there's actually a disk space issue, and if there is, it opens a ticket in ServiceNow, a ticket number that we see in the active logs, and then acknowledges the alert in SolarWinds. Let's see that ticket in ServiceNow. Back to the process. The workflow successfully cleaned some space, deleting old and large log files in some temp folders and the recycle bin. If we take a look at SolarWinds, we'll see that our alert has disappeared. iShare will then close the ticket in ServiceNow and close the incident in iShare. So now let's quickly review the SolarWinds and ServiceNow related actions in our workflow. On the left, you see the list of actions iShare offers, including the SolarWinds integration actions. The alert from SolarWinds is received with detailed information, fields like alert ID, alert name, host name, etc. In the ServiceNow create record action, we'll open a ticket in ServiceNow with all of the requested details we gathered from SolarWinds and iShare. With the SLNMP Acknowledgement Alert action, we'll send acknowledgement to SolarWinds with the ticket number we opened, and we'll update the ticket with this information. When integrating iShare with SolarWinds Network Performance Monitor, you can reduce resolution time and noise of alerts, critical incidents, 
and important changes by automating cross-platform IT tasks in an easy and intuitive way. This concludes our SolarWinds NPM integration. For further information, please contact our support team or visit our website at www.iyahoo.com.